hair look bad? <laughs> you know it's going to be a uh, good interview when the girl walks in and goes, I figured I'd forget the crown and sash and just put my boobs out and we'll call it a day. Trib Live Radio, hopefully you're subscribed to the YouTube channel by now because if you are, then, well, you know why it's a good thing to be subscribed to the channel. I'm Justin Labar, alongside our Blush feature every single week, Blush Night Street downtown. Everybody ends up a Blush, and this week for an extended nice long week, mm -hmm. Simone Dana Lustrious. Hey, Mary Say it God. correctly. Yeah, How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm great. So Simone has come back to us. Last time she had uh, her entire royalty gimmick going on for all the prestigious awards <laughs> I did. that she holds. <laughs> and uh, but in re today she'd rather just just rock this, which just, just show giving a little preview no of what complaints. you'll see live. I gotta <laughs> say, you know, we, we're very privileged here. You know, Blush <laughs> brings in a lot of a lot of good girls. I gotta say, you got to be in the top three all time of best looking naked. Thank you. And that's a, that's a simple statement, but there's a lot of weight to that statement because some girls can come in and they can they can really tease the package, and then when you open the package, you know it, it is what it is. But if you see her naked, you're getting your money's worth for sure. And you can check out naked Third selfies straight. on Twitter. And you can check out my naked selfies on Twitter at, at love, Sim love Simone. Love Simone. At love Simone. I'm glad you didn't put your last name in your handle because that would have I, eaten <laughs> up all 140 characters. No, no, no. I, I even I know better than that. All right. All right. Before we get into the uh, funner stuff, uh, let's let's catch up on all the titles because uh, this is it's kind of fun to keep track of, but it's kind of stressful because you were just y you know what? But I've been writing them down so much because it seems like every time I write them down on the list, mm -hmm. it never gets back to me. So I've had to do it so many times in the last like three weeks. Literally, I'm just it's by rote. But watch, I'm gonna mess it up right now. Okay. Okay. So I am 2013 Miss Nude North America. Uh -huh. 2012 Miss Nude North America. Mm -hmm. 2013 Miss Nude Midwest. Though I will be losing that title today because they're holding the contest. And so congratulations to whoever wins tonight. Um, well, I'm, I'm okay with you losing it because it means you're here. So. I know I am here. <laughs> I am 2013 Miss Nude Go Go. Three time Queen of the Stage. Two time hottest stripper as seen in blah blah blah. In insert things here yeah. and you'll hear it, and you'll hear it many more times if you go to blush just as she's getting ready to go on the stage and they give you the grand I have a lot of I have a lot of naked titles well hence it goes back to my point of saying you when you're naked you it, I'm it, naked it's a weird <laughs> it's a weird statement to make but I was trying to feel like I was trying to like sum up my compliment to you when I was driving in here I was like I just gotta say she just looks looks good naked and and that's the best compliment you give me absolutely well let's talk about this 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 kind of uh, cracks me up so uh, anybody that follows uh, Simone close enough or remembers our past conversations you'll know she's a good friend of another uh, girl that we are always happy to have in Pittsburgh the hurricane Lacey rain uh, or Lacey and the Lacey. hurricane <laughs> they are they are besties so to speak and Apparently, <laughs> that fiery redhead, I don't know what she was well, thinking. She's blonde now. Oh, that's right. She's All the more reason that, I'm that mad at her. smoking blonde. All the more reason I'm mad at her, Lacey. <laughs> if you hear this, I'm talking to you. Tried to church Simone up. <laughs> now, I'm not much of a religious person in the first place, so I don't like any term of church, but especially when you take a very nice, beautiful, good-looking, especially when naked, girl and try to church you up. You know, it wasn't bad, though. It was a nice change. She was like, you don't know. Don't lie. Just. Uh, no, I know really for a moment it was I, right. I did freak out um, She was like, you know, we should just try to be a little more pretty like naturally pretty You know like get rid of some of the crazy and just mm. be pretty girls So she went blonde mm -hmm. and she decided to that I should be a brunette You know she gave me like some red highlights, but sure. you know and some blonde highlights um, And when she did my hair, I freaked out for like like a few yeah. hours, like I'm in her house and I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, you know. Cause I would freak out if I saw you with one straight hair color. It's, it's been years since I've looked anywhere near normal, <laughs> which is a weird thing to say. <laughs> no, um, you have an exotic look. That's how thank that's you. Right. And so I rocked that for a while, and recently it's just, it's been getting it to me again, mm. where I'm like, I can eat color in my life, and so Even I find the eyelashes, like, if you can see that on oh, camera. My, yeah, my eyebrows are. Or the eyebrows, excuse me. Yeah, they, they look good though. Thanks. You, it, it works for you again. I don't know if it's the skin tone it's, or what it is. I don't know. Oh, it's just my thing now, but that's how I feel very comfortable again. I told her I, before I saw it at our last booking, I'm like, I'm sorry, dude. Like, I put mm -hmm. my colors back in the hair. She's like, it's okay, whatever. <laughs> gotta be you. Yeah, yeah gotta be me. Yeah, it wouldn't be. <laughs> it wouldn't be you if you if you came in more conventional. I, that you would have been a little. Would you have fallen down dead? Maybe. I wouldn't have fallen down dead, but it would just you know I. I be less fun right now. Uh, well, yeah. Well, well, yeah. If you, if she churched <laughs> up to the point to where you were doing this, <laughs> I travel my ass to uh, New Hampshire, Massachusetts, wherever the hell, whatever. Wherever you are, lazy wherever she's at up there. <laughs> now, something that's a, a, a good sentence, a, a good teaser, a good tagline for all of you uh, 
that are planning uh, to go to blush, or if you're not planning, this will make you want to go to blush. Simone said that she has decided to embrace her sexuality. I am embracing my sexuality, and what I. What does that mean? Uh, I recently started. I recently stopped. You know, I just changed my look. I was mm -hmm. like, you know. I'm not the good girl. You know, Lacey and I always joke because we're the, you know, Skankasaurus Rex, right? I know you love that name. Um, that, like, I'm the Skankasaurus and she's the Prudasaurus, you know? <laughs> right. And so I finally decided I'm just going to embrace that, you know? And I'm going to, you know, if you're going to see me live naked. Sure. There's already stuff that you can find of me naked. I might as well, you know, give my people what they want and stay true to myself. So I've started like putting naked selfies on Twitter, mm. you know, and being like, come see me. And honestly, the response has been really good. You know, I, I, sex sells. I, it, sex sells. I, I wouldn't be here if it didn't sell. <laughs> sex sells. <laughs> sex sells. And at, you were, I, I think I've told you this before, you were going to get the offer. And you probably already have. <laughs> but there will be the number. There is going to be that offer of, folks, you can have her on DVD at, at your house. That's going to come. Do you think so? Yes. I don't know. That's kind of before, but no. 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 Stayed away from that. I this, you know, like I've done like, you know, some amateur fetish stuff. Mm -hmm. I've done um But this I, would be the perfect time because I mean, obviously every day that you every day that you hold out it builds more anticipation, it drives your leverage up, so to speak. And now I, you, <laughs> if you're embracing the sex if look, if, if we're gonna embrace the sexuality, I mean You know, but there but I have to draw the line somewhere. You wanna still keep something it, well because private. it's like I love dancing. Mm -hmm. It's my it's my passion. Well you're damn good at it, obviously. And thank you very much. Um but there are days because it's become my job now where I'm like, Oh, I have to dance today, mm. you know, and I get like you know, because it's work sometimes. Sure. Because, you know, it's not a, fun a funny job, game. But it's still a job. Yeah. Okay, so imagine you take that and it's sex now. Right. I am a completely sexual person. I love sex in all its forms. But I would hate to wake up one day and be like, I have to have sex today. You know, I don't ever want to feel that way. Well, I want it to. Well, and that's a fair explanation. That, that then goes to you have the leverage. That's when you don't necessarily have to sign a contract where you have to do. In a, uh, some large volume of maybe 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 it's, it's very select. Maybe maybe you only put out you know five scenes a year, something really select. It's just I, I don't know. My mom's already probably horrified right now. By the way, hi mom. I know your Twitter stalking me right now. Hi, so mom. I hope you like the selfies. <laughs> yeah, oh, oh. Since you brought mom, can I ask? I, I mean, uh, is she supportive? Yes, okay. she is. Cool. Um, but it's funny because the only times I ever hear from my mother are when I fall. And post about it. Um, <laughs> on, or, on stage, you mean, or just in life? I, I, I had a really bad fall off stage, yeah. <laughs> um, we'll, we'll talk about that later. Okay. And uh, when I do some, when I post like a, a, a comment that's kind of, you know, racy mm. or a naked picture of myself. She'll text me. She'll tweet at me, so every one of my fans can see my mother scolding me. That's pretty bold, of her, then, actually. I'm just like, well, because like, I, well, I'm gonna be honest. I blocked her from Facebook. <laughs> <'Cause she's, laughs> Does she know that? Or yes, not? she knows okay. this because she unfriended me a few times because we got, <laughs> we got Bre breaking family news. You've, un <laughs> you've been blocked on Facebook. She knows. She's blocked from Simone Dennalustrous. Yeah, she can't. <laughs> she can't. <laughs> she's not allowed on. Mom, this is Justin talking here. If I can give you. A piece of advice it would be this embrace the fact that you produced this Hi. you produced this <laughs> i mean I, you had no idea when she was coming out of your womb 20 something <laughs> years ago that this would be worth so much money it's true <laughs> mom have me over for dinner i will we will we'll take care of us we will we will we'll hash this we'll, out we will, yeah exactly we'll smooth <laughs> things over never mind what your daughter's wearing um <laughs> All right, so you can see her at Blush, Ninth Street downtown. Uh, follow her on Twitter at Love Simone. Anything else going on we should know? Any any any, any theme to the shows we should expect? Any surprises? Um, it, there's always gonna be surprises. It's gonna get um, the shows are gonna get a little wetter, a little messier. Um, I have a, like I said, like the last time I was here, I have a full range, mm. so I'll be going from doing something rock to doing something uh, burlesque to doing mm. something in you know go go y. It's I'm I'm going on the range like this. Go ahead and take you on a ride. She's taking you on a ride, and she's embraced her sexuality. <laughs> I've embraced Get it. Get to blush. <laughs> nice Street Downtown. Follow them on Twitter at Blush Exotic, at Love Simone. Make sure you subscribe to the Trib Live Radio YouTube page. And for God's sake, when you show up to blush, do not tell her to church it up. She will <laughs> smack you, and then I'll smack you. Uh, there's plenty more coming up today on Trib Live Radio. Probably some talk about hockey, but who cares about hockey right now? We got Simone, Dana Lustre. Hey. We're back.